this house is a long way from a town or village and it's too far away to get a normal telephone service. Instead, the telephone service is provided by Satellite Dish. Now, being a long way from town, this house doesn't have mains power either, so the Satellite Dish and Telephone need their own source of power. And so they use solar panels. Now, to make sure that the telephone has enough power for three days during cloudy weather, the solar panels need to have as much sun as possible on good days. The problem is, quite often, there are trees in the way. Those trees stop the sun getting onto the solar panels, probably mainly in the early morning or late evening. So we need to get this tree cut down. It's in the way. But to get approval to cut a tree down, you need to know its height. To do this, we're going to use trigonometry because it's too dangerous to have a ladder up against a tree or to climb up the tree and hang a tape measure down. So we're going to use trigonometry. And without too much difficulty, there are two things that we can measure to help us find the height of this tree. First up, we can measure the distance, and we'll call it D, from the solar panels to the tree. And we're going to say that this is 30 metres for this example. We can also measure the angle of elevation from the solar panels to the top of the tree. And we're going to call that angle theta. Now that angle of elevation can be measured using an inclinometer. Fairly easy. It's a simple manual little instrument that we can use. Once we have found those two measurements, we can use the tangent ratio to find the height of the tree, the last thing we need to find. So we're going to find the height of this tree. Now, we formed a triangle here. There's the right angle. We've got our triangle. We've got the hypotenuse. We've got the opposite. Whoops, we've got the opposite. And we've got the adjacent. So we've got the opposite. And we've got the adjacent. So we can use the tan ratio to find the height of this tree. So let's do that real quick. We've got tan theta equals the opposite over the adjacent. So in this case the opposite was the H and the adjacent was D. Now let's put a number there. Let's say that's 15 degrees. We can now plug all the numbers in that we know and we're going to change our equation around ready to plug into a calculator. So we go and grab our calculator and we need to do 30 times 10, 15. So we're going to do 30 times, on this calculator we have to press the 15 first before the 10. Press equals. There you go. Our tree is approximately 8 metres high. So very quickly we found that this tree is 8 metres high. We can include that on the application form to the council to get the tree removed letting them know that this tree and whatever other trees that we've measured their height. Now we've got lots of sun on our solar panels which is going to charge our batteries which is going to let this phone work for, th for three days if there's no sun shining on the solar panels because the batteries will be fully charged.